Hey everyone, welcome to the channel. Uh, this is an unboxing video for the Black Mat, and if you want to like, subscribe, hit the bell, comment, share, anything you do does help the channel and is greatly appreciated. And if you want to go to my Patreon and try to get yourself a mug or sticker or something like that, that's where you can do that. It helps also. And everyone, what I'm trying to do with my Patreon is if everybody can put in a dollar a month, if we had like 120, 130 people who put in a dollar a month, you can have your shot at a draw. I'll give away, uh, I'll use that money to get like a silver Zippo, a silver 41, a silver vintage, a silver classic, or a gold plated Zippo, or a really nice expensive armor one, right? I'd, I'd, if we can get like 100, generate 120 bucks a month on there, if everyone chips in a dollar, everyone who chips in the dollar can be in a draw for that Zippo every month. I'll do it on live stream and we'll have a draw for that Zippo. That's what I'm really trying to do with my Patreon. So. If anyone wants to help and join out and build it up so I can give away a cool Zeppo every month, uh, please join up. Hey everybody, how you doing? Welcome to today's video. Uh, what I have to show for you today is the black mat. Uh, I bought five of these things. Uh, they were very cheap. Uh, you can get them for about 10, 12 bucks on eBay. Uh, I know the price tag on them does say, what does that say? 21, 21.45, but uh, I got these for like 11 or 12 bucks and it's a pretty good deal it's ready to go it is a i20 so this is a newer one it's last year's model so that's pretty good didn't get any old ones uh, they're all the same actually they're all the same stamp on the bottom uh, I bought them from a dealer on ebay uh, I went ahead and opened up this one put a pipe insert in it I just like the look of it like the sound of it I think a brass insert looks a little better in here to be honest they look pretty cool uh you open it up and here i'll show you actually let's see i think i got a, I got a brass insert laying around here somewhere let's see let's see what she looks like with the brass Yeah, way nicer with the brass. I love a brass insert inside a black Zippo. It looks really sharp. So if anyone thinks about changing it up, I think you should. But I got these uh, I got these steel ones specifically to go inside of these ones. That's why you've seen in my other video, I ordered five pipe inserts, five Zippos. There's a reason. <laughs> I'm putting all the inserts in there. And like I said, I'm going to do them up and do things with them. But those are videos for future days. Uh, the black mat's really nice because you could just take the finish off and make this a canned bottom brass zippo. If you want a brass zippo, it's a real good way to get one for cheaper than what a brass zippo costs. You just got to soak this in acetone or nail polish remover and then just you got to scrub it a bit and it'll come right off. It'll get underneath and it'll all come right off uh, pretty simply and it'll look nice underneath. And uh, the black mat came out in 1984 and... It sparked a, a whole new generation of different Zippo designs and things they put on Zippos and different color Zippos. So the black mat does have its place in history. It is a pretty cool Zippo. Uh, everyone should have one or two in their collection. I actually have a, I actually have a Niagara Falls black mat. This is an old, old one. It is beat up and dinged. I got it. I didn't, I didn't own it. I got it that damage and everything, but that's an old Niagara Falls one. You can't see because back then they used to mat over the over the bottom, and you can't see that it is, but if you hold it up to the light, you can see it says Niagara Falls on it and everything like that. Uh, if you want to go see, you can go uh, in my, um, my unboxing video of that Zippo. Uh, Zippo, another rare find, I believe it's called, and uh, you can see that it's a Niagara Falls Zippo. It has a Niagara Falls insert, too. So, everyone, I think you should go get a black mat Zippo. They're nice and cheap. Uh... If you want to use a Zippo for work, I think this is a good Zippo to use at work because you don't see the black oil from your hands on it. Uh, and it gets scratched, only the paint gets scratched, and you'll always have a nice brass finish underneath. So if you do wear the Zippo out where the finish is really bad, well, you can just take it all off and have a new brass Zippo to uh, ruin. <laughs> so anyways, guys, uh, take care. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for checking out the vid. And uh, <clears throat> I'll see you in the next one, guys.